Hey guys, in the previous video we saw how we can download and install MinGW compiler on our PC and in this video we are gonna see how we can download and install Sublime Text on our PC and set up it for C++. So let's start. So first of all, you have to go to sublimetext.com and on this page, click on download for windows button. Once it is downloaded, open the executable file. So I'm just gonna go to my download location and open the executable file so it will ask for permission just click on yes and then click on next and click on next again and then click on install so once it is installed click on finish so sublime text is installed on our system so i'm just gonna close this window so and uh, search for sublime text in our search bar so just open the app and then you'll see this window once you open sublime test so now you we have to make a build system for our c++ so for that go to tools and go to build system and go to new build system click on it now we have to paste some code which i'll give in the description so i'm just gonna see the code and paste it here so just paste this code right here and save it save it with the name let's say competitive programming and we have to give it extension of sublime hyphen build so sublime hyphen build and let's just save it so now it is saved now we'll make layout for our environment so just close this window and go to tools no go to view so go to view and go to layout and click on columns equals to three and then again go to view and go to groups and click on max columns equals to two so we'll see something like this this is layout of our competitive coding environment so this is the window where i will give my input for my program and this is the window where i will get my output and this is the window where i'll write my code so let's make three files the first file will be c++ file so let's just make a c++ file press ctrl plus n and and then press ctrl plus s to save this file so just go to the folder where you want to save this file so i'm gonna save this file in my code forces folder so let's just give it a name let's say temp dot cpp so we have to give it extension of cpp which means c plus plus so let's just save it now here i will make a input file so just press ctrl plus n and ctrl plus s so and i have to save it in the same folder as i have made my c++ file so in my code forces folder i will give it a name of input f dot in so it's uh, showing me that this file already exists but i'll just replace it so in this window what i have to do is i have to make a new file of for output so i'll press ctrl plus n and then ctrl plus s so this file will be named as output f dot in so this this also will be saved in the same folder now just click on yes so we have made our three files here now let me show you a code that will run on our system so let's just write a hello world program so for that so i have made my code now to build it just press ctrl plus p so now okay so i have to choose my build system first 
so just go to tools and then to build system and click on competitive programming the build system that we have created earlier so just click on it now press control plus b now let's see so we can see that in my output window i'm getting hello world so that's it for this video guys and in the next video we'll see how we can make templates to code faster so thank you for watching